Regeneration is looking at the way that buildings and areas can be improved to serve their local communities. Um, so things have changed over the last few years where buildings have changed what they're being used for. So they tend to be less tenanted in the town centres at the moment. So within the regeneration team, what we're looking at doing is improving the buildings, improving the look um, and their structural integrity um, and looking at ways to make them serve their communities better. Um, Beth ydy adfywio yn ei gyfanrwydd, mwyna lai gwella, gweithio hefo'r gymuned i wella beth sydd yna. Um, bod hynny'n gallu bod yn adfywio um, ffisegol lle dyn ni'n gwella yr eiddo sydd o gwmpas, siopau gwag, fflatiau o'r achos ben, siopau sydd wedi dynyddio ys blynyddoedd, gwella, siopau sydd ac eiddo sydd y mewn defnydd, ond wrach angen buddsoddiad er mwyn cadw'r bobl yna nid yn fwy ganaliadwy. Um, ond hefyd, gweithio'r gymuned i dod i nabod cyfleoedd sydd wedi cael eu colli, gall hynny fod yn fforddiant ac addysg, a felly ail gyflwyno bobl um, i cyfleoedd gwaith felly yn yr ardal. A pethau fel yr amgylch y lleol hefyd, felly ar llwybrau seiclo felly yn yr ardal. Felly rhywbeth sydd yn gallu denu bobl i'r ardal a cadw bobl yn yr ardal mewn ffordd cynaladwy. Felly dyna ydy ffordd dwi'n gweld adfywio yn ei gyfanrwydd. I think revitalising the high street is massively important and it's getting sort of those shops back where we had a high street full of a butcher, a baker, a greengrocer. People go into the high street, they make friends, they meet people, it reduces loneliness. They're using local produ produce which reduces food miles and it's just an all better experience, I think. We're working with our regeneration team. We've been able to secure funding to refurbish re a shop on the high street in Shotton, which has been a fantastic opportunity for us. That's something we've wanted to do for quite a while. We've been working on food poverty and flint shifts for three to four years now. So that's always been um, something for us, that we, an ambition that we've wanted to have, like a shop, well, not like, it is a shop front to be able to... Um, cook the food in our shop and kitchens and then s serve it in the shop. So meals made from scratch, healthy, nutritious meals to then be able to sell in the shop and support the, the local residents that they can pop in. So it's all, but it's also regenerating a shop that has been derelict for a while. So it's bringing the, the, um, the high street better for the residents and obviously there's more choice for them rather than nipping into I don't know we won't give any names of any other shops but maybe not as healthy an option but um yeah so we're working with them and then upstairs we've had the opportunity so working with our homeless section there we're refurbishing that to be a one bedroom flat so which are in short supply in, in Flintshire one bedroom properties so that would be great to have the opportunity to be able to for someone to have that as their home and then there's also an opportunity maybe they can work there's um to be able to be employed if that's something that they required and um to work in the shop there's an opportunity so yeah that model is something we've been wanting to do for a while so we're really looking forward to hopefully certainly by the end of this year the the shop will be open and there'll be an opportunity 31 Chester Road is an interesting case. That building itself was a disused building. So, you know, it was looking at with, with colleagues from within Flinch County Council um, and Can Cook as well with Robbie, um, how that building could be used better. And what we did is it was mainly um, the other teams within Flinch County Council, but they came to us with what their proposal was to, to how they were going to use the building, along with obviously Robbie's involvement as well, because he was going to be the user of it. Um, and we then, with a facilitator, in going out and getting the funding, primarily for the um, for the buildings. So our role was more about you know an important factor, which is getting the money in place and making sure it's there, ready for the uh, for the for the development to take place. Felly, dyna ni hefyd yn gweithio perchennog, um, perchennogion adeilad um, arall yn y sir, lle nath yr tenantid wythau ddim ail agor o'r ôl Covid, um, felly mae'n adeilad amlwg yn ganol dref, ganol dref o Flint, um, a dyna ni gweithio perchennogion yn i gael defnydd cynaladwy iawn yn fan, felly bydd hwnnw hefo paneli solar yn sylweddio o safon gorau, felly a bydd o'n Mae cyfle i cwmni lleol dyddu hefyd yma, sydd beth pwysig hefyd, lle nid yn unig, fyddwn nhw'n cyfle, mae yna gwneud i chi symud i fewn yna, ond fyddwn nhw'n gallu lluniau clir iawn i ehangu'r busnes, a fe hwnna'n fodd i wneud hynny. A potensialau hynny wedyn ydy fyddwn nhw'n cynyddu'r bobl sydd yn dod i ganol tre flint, ac yn gallu um, gwario mwyn siop eraill yn yr ardal hefyd, felly nid jys helpu i'n busnes i 
neud rhywbeth yn y sir, mae'r potensiau, mae'r spin-offs o hynny yn, yn fawr. Felly, dyna'r math projectau yn gweithio'r hyn o bryd ar gwahanol efelau. Um, From regeneration, it's not just about um, buildings that have nobody in there, like 31 Chester Road. It's also about buildings that currently have people in there. You know, and it's just regenerating that building to make it more fit for purpose. That's, that's what I would say. So it's not just a building that's not being used. We also want to you know, speak to people that own buildings that currently have tenants in that want to improve it. And then you know, we'll have, want to get involved in projects like that. Lle dyna ni'n awyddus iawn i ddasblygu perthynas hefo'r bobl sydd yn defnyddio'r afon yn barod a sydd hefo potensial i, um, i ddasblygu'r defnydd o'r afon, bod hynny'n sefydlatau addysg, bod hynny'n um, defnyddio'r presennol ac i greu economi sydd yn seilio o gwmpas yr afon. Um, Eiddeid bod hynny'n gyfer twristiaeth, bod hynny'n gyfer hamdden neu'r gyfer dibidiant um, o gynnyrch i rhywbeth bod o'r and a postcard maybe but actually my potential and a girl at win credinial mercy the gal impact maori own ar 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 aftal or so she need an hour nag so man a lot she dang in need on do up on a lot of better actually need just through picker a tapion for in with in a quick your bubble yawn when i want it more actually need